get him out of the weather. And um, he, he, he had a look on his face like, are you crazy? Or um, it was a cross between, are you crazy? And are you serious, man? You, re you really want to do this for us? And uh, I just kept reassuring him, man, I'm not playing with you. I'm serious. Here's the money. I showed him money. Three rooms for three or four nights, it was 450 bucks. And I could rent a house for five or 600 bucks a month. And the reason why we, we named it the House of Hope is a little kid, nine-year-old kid, had all the tent city over the bridge while they were coming, going home from Foodland. And he had a class project coming up and he built a tent city. And he made it a school project. And he said he wanted to build a tent city at home. He said, uh, me and my grandma was riding by where you guys stay at. And he said, I thought of my project. And I said, really? And he said, yeah. He said, uh, he said, I wanted to build the house of hope for you. And I asked him why. And he said, because when I rode by, I asked my grandma when it rains, did it get wet? And uh, he said, when it's cold, do they get cold? And he said, he wanted to build a house to keep us from getting wet or being cold. So um, that meant a lot to me for a little kid to do that. And uh, he told me he made the project two days before we were kicked out of Tent City. Stability feels amazing. To actually be doing what I'm supposed to be doing instead of something I'm not, it's, it's a great thing. It's a great thing.